What's up guys, Barry Gaming here, back with some more Idle Heroes, and today we're finally back on the free-to-play account. We've been kind of idling along during this Chinese New Year event, and well, uh, we're kind of in the point where we want to make a decision. So as you guys know, we don't quite have the 800 scrolls we need. We would be a little short of the guarantee, however... Technically, there are ways to high roll in this event. There's ways to get, you know, some additional resources. Mainly, the one that I'm kind of intrigued in is getting these crystals of transcendence, plus, of course, a treasure from this event. Uh, again, going for like, you're not really guaranteed to get this transcendence hero. I've seen people literally get a transcendence hero on their first like account unlock it if you guys are wondering what i'm talking about if you just jump on over to some of your random random accounts that you might not even be using you might actually be one of those lucky people because like if you just jump into this event on here uh you just jump on over the first hero is always just going to be pre-populated so you might be one of those lucky people that just somehow hit something really good. Uh, let's just try one of our other accounts that have been sitting for a while. Uh, it's a very, it's a literally a one percent chance that it could happen to you. But we have so many comeback accounts. Uh, oh, I thought I thought that was Vulcan for a second. But as you guys can see, the first hero can technically high roll you into something absolutely insane. Now, sadly, we've already done the fifty uh, points for getting five star heroes. We've already done all of that right here. We've used our 50, which are five of these, and we haven't seen anything. So really, the only other thing to do is Heroic Summons. But as we talked about, if we don't care about getting necessarily the reward here, but we still want to get a reward from this section right here for 26, we need to do 800 scrolls. And again, we are very short on it. So going to keep collecting scrolls we're going to see how close we can get again the only other thing that i was even considering doing which i don't think is a really great idea is something like getting some of these packs here that's also going to mean we get some charm treasure tickets which is interesting to think about uh and it is giving us those heroic summons because of course if we do take a look at the summoning prizes you would get 30 per loop so we would get 60 of them from here uh, our monthly events are going to be refreshing too. So that's another 10 scrolls from here. Uh, that's, I think, even more. Another 10 scrolls from here. So there's multiple ways that we can still get more things out of this. So we're just going to have to see how that works out. Now, there are a couple things that we haven't done just yet. And that is we haven't done all the Leaping Flame stuff just yet. So we're going to jump in here. Uh, and we're going to see how far we can get on this. So again, certain pieces are more important to go for. Uh, so number one, we definitely want to go for those scrolls right there because that's really important. We want to go for those cores of transcendence. We want to go for the stellar shards. Uh, I don't know about the treasure train ticket. The relics might be good. The skin isn't that big of a deal. But we should be able to unlock this whole picture here, which shouldn't be a problem, right? 15, 30. Oh, yeah, actually we do. We unlock the entire picture. So we do get those bonus rewards. And on top of that, we are grabbing a treasure. So that's not too bad. Again, if we do more summons, though, we will get more rewards. We can get puppets, which are going to be coming in handy. Uh, honestly, this festival skin for like a transcendence hero in the future would be pretty solid, too. But I don't think we're going to get up to 200 points. Uh, what we've done so far has been decent. Uh, and we've already spent quite a bit. We got 131 points on this guy here. So not too bad. And we're keeping up with this, which is good and giving us some rewards. So next thing we need to do here, I've already started over during this week, a second collaboration here. So uh, if we can get some of these done too, that could be another 30 scrolls. I just got to do it on both of ours. And I think we can do this. Oh man, I gotta do free team arena then, I guess. Is that actually open right now? Not, nah, it starts in an hour. Okay, so maybe we can get another 30 there. I think there is a way for us to get to 800 scrolls. It's just gonna take a little bit of luck. Uh, so I think we might go for it. Bonus rewards are what they are pretty much. Uh, we are gonna get another bag free at some point, but yeah, that does gives us more cores of transcendence too, which we can just jump over here, chuck them in. We're not gonna get any spheres or anything like that because of course we are going in guidance, but using these up uh, is gonna give us more of those pieces. And hey, we managed to hit a tick copy, so that is really, really awesome to see right there. And I will take it. And as we see, that gives us another single point. <laughs> It doesn't really do much. Uh, we got to get up to 150 and we're at 132. So again, we might do this to get additional rewards. I just don't know how greedy I want to be 
or if I want to keep saving up our contract starry gems, which would probably be the smart play here. Uh, the only other difference is we would get more treasure train type stuff, which crafting this is great because that gives us more stats. Now we literally just got what? By doing this, we got, I mean, <laughs> almost 50,000 attack and we got some maim damage for the void, uh, which is pretty solid. So yeah, overall stats that just basically doubled our fixed attack on our heroes. So ooh, ooh, that's actually pretty spicy. And if we can get more of those treasures unlocked, that would be good. So again, really questioning, but there is something we do need to do because of, uh, we were talking about how we have those collaborations. We could hit something good here. Kind of hoping we hit like a demon bell. So let's see what this mysterious artifact fortune chest has in store for us. Oh, we hit the demon bell. And that is exactly what I wanted to see. Because eventually we're going to upgrade more demon bells and such. Uh, but for the time being, yeah, that's actually really, really good. Because even if we're running other heroes like carries and stuff, energy artifacts are something that we've been waiting to kind of progress with. Uh, we have, of course, slowly been getting more stellar shards and we are gonna get even more from the end of this event right here. But yeah, we've almost got two nodes done. So we're almost at V4. And like I said, we already have, uh, what, 225 here. I think if we do go in and do the summoning prizes too, we do get more tickets. We, of course, get more cores. More importantly, we get some Patricia copies. And I kind of want to see what we can do with Patricia on this account as potentially like a second transcendence hero. So getting the copies wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. Uh, and then I don't know if we're gonna buy any of these. So there's a lot of decisions to be made on our free to play. I'd love to hear what you guys think. If it's worth spending any of our contract starry gems here to get like a pack or something like that, it could be worthwhile, I don't know like get like 84 from here which would put us over 700 and then we have other things coming in we'd have 30 60 more coming in from the loops we then also have our monthlies coming up to oh geez oh i missed out on gems i'm so stupid that could have been so useful but yeah so there's a lot of different options for us here we're getting more scrolls coming up this week so i'd love to know what you guys think personally also for the rest of the week start buying these up maybe just to try to push for it but it's definitely possible we're going to do the summons if we do them off screen because as you guys can see bag space is a real real issue on our free to play and wow is it really a big issue um, we are hurting for bag space my goodness are we hurting for bag space so if we do summons i will do them offline but i'd love to know your guys feedback it's awesome we hit an additional demon bell so far and we're just gonna have to see how we end out on this event so hopefully you guys enjoy this one make sure you guys take one second leave a comment down below let me know what you think we should do uh, again i'm pretty sure we can get to 800 scrolls which is the important part to guarantee loot and then we just have to see if we high roll on this event right here let me know what you guys think i'll see you guys next time